Following the halting of the November 7th presidential runoff by Liberia's Supreme Court on Monday, an electoral crisis could ensue in the West African country. Several political parties, including the ANC party led by Alexander Cummings, Charles Bramskin of the Liberty Party who challenged the results of the October 10th poll, and two other first-round candidates have rallied behind Vice President Joseph Boakai and vowed to fight to ensure the credibility of the vote. On this we are united. I want to ensure, I want to thank our legal process, the Supreme Court, for being able to arrest the situation, to redirect all of what <coughs> NEC has done to ensure that Liberians will get what they deserve for their country. Meanwhile, George Weah, leader of the Congress for Democratic Change Party, who garnered 38.4% of the vote, called for calm, maintaining that his party was in the lead. I want you to know that you have won the first round and you are in the lead. Continue on to be peaceful while we observe the new process. Outgoing President Ellen Johnson Sirleaf in a radio address warned that democracy in Liberia was under threat. Monday's ruling could push back the runoff date by weeks or even result in the first round of the election being run.